everybody welcome or welcome back to another video of me making stuff it's been a while since we sat down here and uh, made a little something something and ow, oh, and while I haven't been putting out sewing content I have definitely been sewing it's just I cannot I could not finish a project for the life of me but yeah I just uh, needed a little bit of time um, I think I'm s kind of settling in back home maybe feeling a little bit lazy but I'm back I'm here with the sewing content I have a vacation coming in literally a week so I'm while the content will come out slowly just know that I am making stuff I'm making my vacation wardrobe Anyways, this lovely dress, um, this is a simple, easy summertime vacation dress. Getting started, I was trying to test my skills at pattern making. So instead of using like a shirt or something, which you still can do I'm not you can do that but instead of using a shirt or anything I like took my own measurements I've cut them out from a cardboard box and cut it as needed I did make it like a little bit too big and honestly I would rather it too big than too small because if it's too small um, you'll have to waste like you you kind of wasted some fabric and it's not gonna look as consistent you know what I mean so rather too big than too small but mine was huge so there was a lot of fabric that I ended up cutting off Okay, so I did the front piece with the bust on it and then the back piece obviously without like a top to it because I wanted the back to be out. I decided to use a French seam because I'm just I'm just so in love with French seams like ever since I found out of their existence it's the only thing that I want to do so next I had some leftover charmeuse fabric from this video go watch it and i used that as the the straps and then also the um i don't know the front part i, I can't the edges you know so yeah i put that together and then brought it through like put it inside out and then put it around just so i don't have to like constantly worry about raw edges point poking out i just you know went ahead and did that so that that's out of the way you know so when i was putting on the um, the charmeuse to the dress I made sure I did it where I put the I'm gonna say edges I put the edges on first the front the very front of the dress and then left those raw edges out and then I covered it when I went with this with the one that was gonna be the strap it's really hard to explain but you have eyes and uh, yeah you 
guys, I'm so happy. I'm finally good at sewing a zipper on. Like this, you just, you truly just need a zipper foot. And that has been my problem is, I had the zipper foot, but I just didn't know how to use it. And that's obviously pretty important, you know. And then I also made a skirt for my mom, which maybe I'll like post on a YouTube short or something. I don't know, maybe. That that zipper is also really good. So just, just letting you know, I'm getting really good at sewing zippers, whatever. It's whatever, you know. Um, at the very end, I went ahead and ironed down all of just just the whole dress. Every seam and, and curve was ironed out, and then I was done. This was a very easy dress that I will probably do on more fabrics like this. Maybe make shorter ones or long, super long ones, or maybe like asymmetric ones, you know? This is just super easy, and... If you don't feel like making it yourself, I am selling this on Etsy. All you have to do is tell me your measurements or give me a generic store size, like small, medium, large, whatever. And I got you. I'll make it under a week and you'll have it in your hands and you can look like me. Yeah, that is it for today's video, guys. It's a little bit of a short one, but I just thought this dress was really cute. So I had to make sure that you had the knowledge to do it yourself i have some very exciting things coming up guys um i just there's there's a lot that has been happening in my life that i'm very excited to share and yeah so stay tuned and then also um the winner of the giveaway i've been talking to her the, a video is coming out soon not not soon honestly like i need time with that but we've been in communication and we will see you guys with the video soon thank you so much for watching if you're new here please maybe consider subscribing i don't know it really helps the channel out and yeah i'm just hoping that maybe maybe i can be hopefully a little bit monetized by the time I go back to school. I would love this to just be what I do. We'll see. Okay guys, um, I'll talk to you soon and stay tuned for the next video next week. Bye!